Evening fellow 50p collectors, Coin Snatcher here. We have an update on the 50p collection. We have a new coin that has arrived today. This is a silver proof 50p issued by the British Antarctic Territory celebrating the Queen's 95th birthday. And this series of coins has various different crown jewels on it. There's this side. If we pop this out of its sleeve, it comes in the Pop Joy Perspex box. Magnetic on it. And pop that off. Let's pop that to the side. Let's pop, what, pop out the coin and have a little look. So, a really nice coin. On it, we can see we've got 50. Uh, we've got the instruments of state, so the orb, the scepter. Uh, we've got the crown, there's another little thing sticking out here which I'm not too sure what that is, not too sure what that is and I don't know why a duck is flapping about in the background, maybe a duck, maybe a penguin, who knows but let's have a little zoom in on that and see if we can see it any clearer. It's a strange looking thing really isn't it, I, I, re <laughs> I really don't know what that is. Nice bit of detail on this coin, but they could have put more detail on it, I think. It's it's just a bit boring, really. And then if we pop this over, we can have a look and see the Queen's portrait. And it's the Pop Joy Mint portrait. We've got the Queen there with a big old necklace on and the Pat Butcher style earrings and a not to show it off type crown, something a bit more subtle than the, the other crown on the other side of the coin. British Antarctic Territory, 2021, and a beautiful proof finish. I do like these Pop Joy silver proof coins. This coin being coming on three, four years old, and there's no toning whatsoever on it. If you had a Royal Mint silver proof coin and it was three or four years old, it'll just about turned to dust by now so we pop that back in and if we have a little look on the cardboard that came with it we can get the specs on it so let's just flip this over so standard weight uh, standard diameter most importantly the issue limits 199 now as we know there's no pop joy mint anymore they've closed down they're not making any more coins very disappointing really for all us collectors but it will save us money and I see these coins especially the silver proof ones which have very low mintages as being coins to hold on to for the future can you imagine in a few years time if these pop joy silver proof coins become popular and people are squabbling over buying one and there's 199 I mean I paid £25 for this. I think it was including postage. There's only 199 of these. There's some people out there who are paying nearly £25 for one of the Salmon 50ps and there's 500,000 of those in circulation at the minute and there's most likely four and a half million of them sitting in the Royal Mint storage waiting to be issued into circulation as and when they're needed. So these 50ps for silver proofs they have incredibly low issue numbers uh, now i would recommend that none of you collectors buy these coins not until i've managed to buy what i need and then by all means go ahead but 25 quid for a silver proof 50p with an issue limit of 199 you really can't go wrong can you pop that on there and we can pop that back in the sleeve and i actually bought this i thought it was a set I thought it was part of this set <laughs> and then I, I realized after I purchased it that it wasn't part of that set so there's another silver proof coin this is a nice one as well look at that it's got Elizabeth Royal lovely looking uh, garland bouquet garland of flowers there and on that one as well it should have a nice low issue this is even lower look that's 170 I mean, it surprises me sometimes how low these issue numbers are on, on the Pop Joy Silver Proof coins. But there we go. We've added another Silver Proof coin into the collection this evening. Happy days. Peace and love. Coin Snatcher out.